probably mentioned the new parts that have come in from the factory. Well, they're all fitted and good to go. I hope they do the trick. to remind ourselves of our top three who are Bottas, Verstappen and Sergio Perez and that's it practice is officially over until next time goodbye well things didn't really go your way today let's have your take you had a mishap in practice will this affect qualifying or race day Are you hoping things clear up before qualifying? How do you feel the competition is for you this season? Appreciate your time. We're all ready for tomorrow's race, but before we begin, let's have a quick look at those who will be fronting the grid. Bottas, Hamilton and Sebastian Vettel. Well, that wraps up qualifying, but don't worry, we'll be back tomorrow as we head into the Grand Prix. Bad luck today. That must be incredibly disappointing. You left some body work out there on the track. Were you struggling for grip? How do you feel about this team's performance this season? Appreciate your time.
It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Good job yesterday from Valtteri Bottas. The Finn starts from pole position and it's Lewis Hamilton alongside. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Vettel, Verstappen, Carlos Sainz and Leclerc, Perez, Ricardo, Stroll and Alexander Elbon, Gasly, Magnussen, Daniel Kvyat and Raikkonen, Grosjean, Ocon, George Russell and Antonio Giovinazzi, Latifi and Richards. Now it's almost time for lights out so let's go down to the track. Now that we've got some points on the board, let's continue this form and aim for another top 10 finish. with the front wing you've taken some minor damage a new strategy is available on the MFD sustain this level of damage. You need to slow down before hitting the corners. We don't want to get a penalty. We've been awarded a time penalty. It will go against our finishing time at the end of the race. Engine off, engine off. See how the driver standings have changed. Our championship leader is still sat at the top of the standings, but their rivals have made up some solid ground today. Now, let's discuss, Ant. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? Charles Leclerc showed exactly how to manage yourself out on the track today. He was almost flawless out there. Incredible stuff. I know that's at odds with the official decision, but I think they deserve some recognition on a day where both of these drivers are at the top of their game. It's time to check out the constructors' standings. Mercedes moved to the top of the table. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. New parts have been completed without issue. They'll be on the car ready for the next race weekend.